every nine minutes someone in the United States is sexually abused. This is a crime that often goes unreported because the victims feel shame or guilt about what happened. And sexual abuse can occur anywhere. Oftentimes we think of it in context with the church or with the Boy Scouts, but really it happens in so many places. It can happen in a daycare setting, in a school. Think about fraternity parties on campus. It can even happen at home or in the workplace. The good news is things have changed. Movements like Me Too, the women's movement, and even most recently the prosecution of prominent abusers has raised the awareness of sexual abuse in our country. The way that survivors are treated has also changed. Often in the past, they were victimized again by the legal system. They weren't believed, they were blamed for what happened to them. We're no longer going to tolerate shaming victims to keep them silent. No one should be subjected to sexual abuse and no one should get away with it. Many states, including Arizona, have changed their laws. This is to allow a longer time to bring a claim. A lot of times the abuse happens when someone's a small child and they don't feel comfortable for years or even decades to come forward and talk about their story and what happened to them, which allows predators to go unpunished. Oftentimes, these cases are not criminally prosecuted. It may be that the county attorney doesn't think there's enough evidence or for a variety of other reasons, but that does not mean that you don't have a civil claim. Even where a criminal case is not pursued, there are still remedies available to you. You may be afraid. You may not be ready to file a lawsuit, and that's okay. We are here to provide you with resources and to discuss your options. Sometimes just telling your story is a first step to healing. Sarah and I, we're here in Tucson. We are part of this community. We've raised our children here, and between us, we have over 50 years practicing law in Tucson. We care. We're here for you. We know it's hard to talk about the sexual abuse you suffered, and honestly, sometimes it's hard to hear, but it needs to be told, and it needs to be heard. Coming forward can not only hold the abuser personally responsible for their actions, it can stop them from abusing again. Tammy and I care, and we're here to help.